Hi Alberto. Hey, how are you doing? I'm very good. So here I am in front of the Segasa battery, the very pretty looking battery. Tell me about it. Thank you very much. Well, as you see, this is a modular system. It's based on our module of uh, 48 volts, 8.6 kilowatt hours. 8.6? Wow. Yeah. That's a lot of we call it the ABIC and some people call it the A brick because in fact it's based on the Lego system where you assemble yes, one yes, on top yes. of each other. I can see, I can see. You can yeah. stack them. And probably what is unique about our system is that it can be connected both in serial and in parallel. Wow. So basically, I mean, we are working on the standard for the 8 volts. We can go on that connecting up to 24 modules in one string that gives us 200 kilowatt hours per string. But we have the possibility to work on higher voltage. For example, right now we are in a project with Selectronic that we are complementing it to their 120 volt uh, SP Pro. So, three, three so in modules of three EVICs, that's a yep. base module that yep. we can also connect in parallel. Yes. So basically on, uh, on 144 volts, we can reach up to one, 1.5 megabytes, two megabytes hour. Yep. So that's what it is. I mean, basically we just launched it together with Electronic under the Empower umbrella and that's where we are going. It's very scalable then. So from, from a 8.6 kilowatt hour unit, you can scale up to megawatt exactly. capacity. Yep. Um, when you're paralleling over here, is, this is your, your unit? That you're yeah, this is the MCP. I mean, every module has their own BMS. Yes. But we have a general BMS that we call MCP that yes. has all the protections and also all the communications in order to do all the parallelization and the contact with the inverter. Right. So it's a fully managed system. Okay. And it requires, obviously, the integration with the inverters that we have with several brands. And, uh, and then, when we work with the strings, each string will have one of these MCPs. And then there will be a, another MCP controlling all the, all the different strings. So yeah, these, are, these are managed yeah. batteries? Yep, the green totally. Ones. You've totally. Got some red ones. Can we have yeah. those? This is a simpler module. I mean, Again, it's an 8.6 kilowatt hours, but in this case, it's self-managed. The BMS is inside and it's self-managed. As long as you can program your inverter, telling them the voltage of, the, of charging and discharge and the current is going to go through, yep. you have it there. It's very, very plug and play. Right. So when you say self-managed, what does that mean? Well, basically, it means that it works uh, like, a, like a lead acid battery. You can use exactly the same inverter. Okay, and the module itself controls all the safety issues. So if there's anything out of control, the battery uh, shuts off. So it's not the inverter giving the order of shutting off, it's the battery itself that does it. So any inverter that works with a 48 volt battery will work with these red EVIX? As long as you can, which is 85% of the inverters, yes. that you can program the voltage of charge and discharge and the currents, those are the only variables that you need to program on the inverter and then it's plug and play. So charge, maximum charge voltage, minimum discharge voltage, exactly. and maximum charge and discharge current. That's where it goes. Piece of cake. With that? Yeah, yeah, piece of cake, yeah, yeah. <laughs> or a piece of brick. Yeah, that's yeah, what it yeah. is. Yes, cool. that's what it is. Well, very simple and very good for retrofitting systems of lead acid. I can see. So this is the point. This one we can scale up to 70 kilowatt hours. 70. Only okay. in parallel. Yes. Only in parallel, not in serial in yeah. this case. Okay. So, yeah, please try it on. Okay. <laughs> Thanks, Alberto. Thank you very much, Glenn. Okay. Nice to see you.